Hey guys, I wanted to do a video on my sales for the last seven days um, of April through the April 20th through today, April 28th, and just kind of show you because I feel like I've been having, for me not to be able to source, I'm selling a lot of um, really random items. Um, so I just wanted to show you kind of some stuff that is selling on Mercari and Poshmark. So the first thing that I sold is this Victoria's Secret pink baby doll lingerie. I took an offer for um, $11 plus shipping. I usually always charge shipping unless I'm shipping the item via media mail. Um, and I paid $1.99 for this at the Goodwill. I also have sold this vintage Little Mermaid wrapping paper. I picked this up for a dollar as well, and this sold for fifteen dollars plus five twenty-five shipping. Um, and it's just literally wrapping paper. Um, it was still sealed, and again, I sold that for $15 plus $5.25 shipping. I also sold this Viva La Bam Season 2 for $12 plus $4.25 shipping. This was a free item. It was my husband's old stuff he got a box of stuff from his parents um and that actually makes up a lot of my sales is a lot of his old random stuff so yeah viva la bam season two um 12 plus shipping i think i'm having such good sales because of just stores being closed it's pushing people to buy online um also another one of my husband's items this was his personal collection um, PS3 Need for Speed Carbon, and I sold that for $17 free shipping. Shipping was about $2.99, so it was about probably $13 profit on this. His PlayStation broke, so, um, we're not planning on replacing it, so I was able to get my hands on all of his PlayStation games. Another item that sold another video game this is a PlayStation 2 game uh, crash bash tag team I sold this for seven dollars plus 299 shipping it didn't do as good as I was hoping I picked it up for two dollars at my local thrift store um, so about four dollars profit but also just happy to get my money back on poor investments Another really random thing that sold is this Blue's Clues book bundle. I sold it for $10 plus shipping. Um, I spent about $0.75. Cents. Each book was a quarter. It was just a coloring book that has stickers in it, had been colored. Um, and then two easy reader books. And again, that was $10 plus shipping. Also sold this. I just sold it today. I haven't shipped it out yet. Um, a broken Wii. We bought a box of video games for $5. And this worked for us for probably six months. And it just stopped reading discs. So I sold it just as is. No cords. Just for parts. And it sold for $10 plus 10 shipping. Um, so my husband wanted to just throw it away in the trash can. And I was like, no, I can sell that. And I did. So, very happy about that. Because, again, if he had his way, it would be have been thrown away when it stopped working. Hey, we see Vanessa. Um, another thing that sold, this actually sold a little over a week ago. Um, I shipped it via media mail, and it is just taking forever to get to its destination. This was also a quarter. I went through my kids' book um, books. And I pulled this out and I looked it up and I sold it for 11 free shipping. It cost about $2.66 to ship this. So, again, I'm just trying to declutter and 
it's working. A lot, of, a lot of just really random stuff. So another thing I sold. We have a lot of video games, and I went through them. And my children don't play this one really anymore. So um, it's a Wii Donkey Kong Jungle Beat, and I sold it for fifteen plus shipping. Like I said, I I usually always charge shipping unless I'm doing it media mail. Um, I sold this as well. It's a PlayStation 1. I put the bundle of two together for 10. Someone messaged me if they could just have just the one game and instead of me re-photographing and everything, since I'm going to have to re-photograph door anyways, I just edited it to all say 101 two Dalmatians. Um, but that sold for $5 plus shipping. And honestly, we probably picked that up for 50 cents. Alright, another thing that sold. This is also from the stuff of my husband's stuff from when he was a child that was given to him by his parents. It's a Mighty Max Doom Zone Man Eater Shark. Um, this just sold last night. And that sold for 20 plus shipping. And I actually have a whole tub of these Mighty Maxes I still need to go through. I only listed just a few of them and they have been selling. Here's another one that has sold. Um, someone messaged me asking if they could bundle two together. So it's the Dinosaur Mighty Max and the Wolf Mighty Max. Um, both of them for 35 plus just about five shipping. Um, and then I've also some that have already been completed. I sold this Grand Theft Auto Vice City um, Vice City Stories. And I sold that for 10 plus shipping. That was in my husband's personal collection. We've just really been trying to do a lot of decluttering. Um, sold this bra lot. Um, three bras. They were actually from one of my husband's co-workers. So they were completely free. And I just listed them cheap just to... I sold them. The, they sold the same night that I had listed them for 10 plus shipping. And then, last but not least, these pink Sperry boat shoes. Um, my husband bought them for me at a thrift store um, for $6. They end up just not being very comfortable on me, about a half size too small. So I sold them for $24, free shipping. Whenever shipping's like $11 on shoes, I know how unappealing that looks. So I always bundle it in with the price. So I made about $11 on these after the $11 shipping for shoes because one pound, three pound shipping on Mercari is not cheap. Um, so I do that just because like I said, I know no one wants to see that they're paying $11 for shipping on a pair of shoes. And then I had two sales on Poshmark. I sold this um, men's gray O'Neill hat for nine dollars so about six dollars uh profit i got that for one dollar not a good investment and another bad investment that also sold on poshmark is this top gun tomcat i literally paid probably two dollars for this and i made two dollars um i've had it for over a year i just at this point i was like you know what when someone sent me the offer for $5, I was like, I'm going to take my money back and run because at least I get my money back and I will probably never buy anything like this again. Even though I have done well on the mountain shirts before, um, but this just was not the case of that. So I hope that you guys enjoyed my video of what's sold. I hope it gives you some ideas and inspiration to list things around your house because I think now is the time because people are selling. Hope you all have a great day. Bye.